Young child accidentally inhales peanut. Peanut is large and it obstructs one of the major bronchi. Obstructed part of lung will collapse. And we get non-expanded lung. This is called atelectasis. Collapsed area can be part of the lung or whole one lung. There are several mechanisms of atelectasis. Above mentioned example is obstruction atelectasis, also called resorption atelectasis. Other examples of resorptive atelectasis are aspiration of a foreign body, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, COPD, and postoperative atelectasis. Atelectasis develops in 90% of people undergoing general anesthesia for a surgical procedure. It is reversible, process, but areas of atelectasis predispose for infection due to decreased mucociliary clearance. Another form of atelectasis is compression atelectasis. When fluid, air, blood, or tumor in the pleural space it can compress the lung contraction atelectasis, or scar atelectasis is due to fibrosis and scaring of the lung. And patchy atelectasis is due to a lack of surfactant, as occurs in hyaline membrane disease of newborn or acute, adult, respiratory distress syndrome. ARDS. Signs and symptoms of atelectasis. Cough, but not prominent. Chest pain, not common. Breathing difficulty, fast and shallow breathing. Low oxygen saturation. Pleural effusion, transudate type. Cyanosis, late sign. Increased heart rate. Diagnosis, clinically significant atelectasis is generally visible on chest x-ray. Findings can include lung opacification and or loss of lung volume. For diagnosis also use chest CT or bronchoscopy if atelectasis is not clinically apparent. Treatment. The primary treatment for atelectasis is correction of the underlying cause if possible. In patients with cystic fibrosis and pneumonia, mucolytic agents such as acetylcysteine is used. Post-surgical atelectasis is treated by physiotherapy, focusing on deep breathing and encouraging coughing. Walking is also highly encouraged to improve lung inflation. Sometimes additional respiratory support is needed with a mechanical ventilator. A blockage that cannot be removed by coughing or by suctioning the airways often can be removed by bronchoscopy. Antibiotics are given for an infection. Chronic atelectasis is often treated with antibiotics because infection is almost inevitable.